Hello, 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 hello. Uh, it's Wednesday night. Hi, I'm here. Everybody, my name is Tracy Winesapple. Leave me a comment if you are here. Happy to be with you all tonight. So if you're wondering, I air my live demos on um, Facebook in uh, on my Facebook page, Tracy Wines Apple Studios. I also am in Art Journaling for Beginners, which is a group that I have. And if you are also curious, I'm on YouTube. So if you want to just leave me a comment from any one of those locations, I'll say hi. Hi, Lori. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi, Anne. And behind the scenes is Tracy Wines. She's Tracy Wines Apple Studios because she's my moderator. Hi, Florence. Hi, Terry. Hi, Alice. Hi, Lisa Larson. Um, Mona. Uh, is it M Myrna? Myrna? Myrna. Myrna? Okay, I might be getting that wrong. I don't like to butcher people's names because my last name is Winesapple. Hola, un saludo from Colombia. Uh, Luisa, uh, my ex-husband, is from Ecuador. Uh, I do not know any Spanish, so I'll do my best. But hola. I'm Tracy. Hi, Marty. How are you? Welcome. If you guys are on YouTube, say hi to me as well. I I try. Oh, there we go. Kay can see me. Oh, my son's calling me. Hold on. Joey, I'm online right now so everybody can hear you. Can I call you back in an hour? Joe? Did you hear me? Joey? Joe, did you hear me? Sorry, I'm a mother. Hold on. Joe, can you hear me? Hold on, I gotta. Uh... Joseph? Oh, okay, hold on. Let me just tell. I'm so sorry. It's my son. Okay, he must have heard me. I answered from my. Uh, that's my son. He'll call back or he heard me. Anyway, um, I, Tracy, I was ordering, uh, but lighting, lightning. I was ordering, but lightning. Sandra, not sure I understand that. I'm always a mom first. Yes. But, uh, he just finished his final. So he's probably checking in. Uh, Kay said, I was surprised when I got the YouTube notification. So glad because I almost forgot when I'm not on Facebook. Kay, thank you so much. Yeah, anybody else on um, YouTube? Uh, Elizabeth, hi. Oh, this is so nice. All right. So my name is Tracy Winesapple. You are in my studio. Every week I do a free demo of some nature. We're going to be in our art journal tonight. It's going to be watercolor night. Uh, oh, uh, bad storms there. Uh, internet in and out. Uh, Sandra, you might have better luck on YouTube sometimes. So um, every Wednesday I go online. Uh, online. I teach a free demo, just uh, basic get to, get to know you fun art. Take time, take a daily habit. Um, I just literally had an appointment. Um, I'll talk more about that later because I share just about everything in my life. Um, but one thing that this doctor's appointment pointed out was that I do something meditative because I don't like meditation um, that calms me down brings things down. Kay, I would love to see a picture of me on your TV because that would crack me up. Um, hi, Mari. Hola. All right. So also I had a few requests for tonight. I have decided uh, to paint. I always paint from the space I'm in. If you guys don't know, I do paint um, every day of my life, pretty much. And um, Wednesday night, I save my painting for tonight. And 
Um, I pretty much switch it up. Let's see what I did last week. I've been kind of busy. I think this was, no. Was this last week? Somebody help me. Help me, Rhonda. Help, help me, Rhonda. Somebody told me today to not stop singing, so I'm not going to. All right, so this was mixed media. This, oh, I'm just messing around, messing around. So this week, I thought, we're going to do watercolors, and I've had a lot of questions, especially if you don't know, I run a group called Art Journaling for Beginners, and it's pretty obvious what that means, but there are all skill levels. There are all skill levels. Um, and I, you know, I get asked, what do, what, what are the basic supplies? I have five basic supplies. If you want an art journal, let's like, let's break it down. Let's keep it simple. So I'll tell you what those five supplies are. But for those of you who are a member of your artful journey, this is your weekly practice. I do have a membership group that we deep dive into every art technique, topic, anything you can think of called your artful journey. So with that, with that being said, just ran out of tape, it's painter's tape. Uh, if you're joining my demo and you expect a big deep dive, we're just scratching the surface because I want to paint with you. So if you guys are in your artful journey, this is your practice. I have to remember to order this. So I'm going to leave this out. And um, don't worry. I'm going to mix my painter's tape. Oh, wait a minute, though. That's going to be an uneven border. That might mess with my OCD. Okay. Hi, everybody. <laughs> And um, I got the question about basic supplies. What do you need to do an art journal? A pen? Um, I, I have five basic supplies that can get me going and get me in a good workspace. My five basic supplies. Uh, number one, oh, that's going to tick me off if I'm not, you don't have a perfect squared off border. But uh, what is my number one? What do you need to get started in art journaling? I'll give you a, a hint. I'll give you a hint. I said art journaling. You need a journal, okay? So then you guys could take it from here. Uh, my five basic supplies. Now, listen, there are five, 15,000 artists in the world. They all have different opinions. I'm telling you my list. So don't, there's no hard written fast rule about this. But I have five basic supplies that make it simple, affordable. You don't need expensive materials. Flip this light on. You don't need expensive materials. You need an art journal, number one. That's easy. It keeps everything contained. And um, number two. And I would say the art journal, mixed media, or watercolor paper. Let's just go there. Uh, Linda just said, hi, everyone. I'm late. And as an old military brat, but I'm not happy about it. Okay, Linda, you're not late. We're still talking. And number two, military brat, also former military wife. And all my kids were born in a military hospital. So you're good. You're good. Uh, welcome, welcome, welcome. I, I just want everybody to know they're welcome. Let me know where you're tuning in. I see several people on YouTube, which is uh, nice. All right. I, I'm so happy you're all here. Anyway, uh, while I'm talking, and I'm going to just do this so you can, oops, sorry, I'm going to do this. While I'm talking, water bottle, nothing special. I'm, I almost said, I'm wetting up the uh, watercolors. Not, if you're new and you've never seen me, I'm inappropriate. I do have the uh, humor of a 12 year old boy. Um, sometimes can be like not politically correct. I try my best. I work with all men in my day job and, uh, I am who I am. That's it. So I do my best. That's all I can say. You love me, <laughs> but I love 12 year old humor, particularly boys. Like that's probably when they start laughing over silly things. 
Anyway, so five basic supplies. An art journal, mixed media paper, or watercolor paper. I'm using a seven by 10 journal. I do have journals on my website. For those of you who have been asking about the eight by eight journal. Oh, let me, let me just digress. Let, I'm so sorry. Let me just go back to the five basic supplies and then remind me to get back to art journals. Okay. You need brushes. I'm not a, I'm a dynasty artisan, so I love dynasty brushes. I'm not a brush snob, but I can tell you what I love about their brushes. I can do most of what I do with a dagger, well, with a round brush or a dagger brush and a liner brush. Okay. Brushes. Number two. Number three, painter's tape. Put it down. I love me a nice clean edge. Number four, some basic watercolors. I don't care if they're praying. Uh, somebody said, I see you using different watercolors. Could you just go back to a basic classic set? I am. Um, you ask, I shall deliver. Okay. Uh, Linda said, I have a five by five by eight and a half journal. Linda's size does not matter. Um, it does not matter in art journaling. I don't care if you're working in a small, large, medium, whatever, gigantic, do your thing. Okay. Uh, and some basic drawing pens. So I got the five supplies. It took me a while to get there. Sharpie fine and ultra fine. Do not worry. I love it. My military people are saying I was born in a base in Japan. I love this. Okay. Thank you. I am USA pro military. Love my military family. All right. Um, <laughs> If you like my sense of humor, thank you very much. Okay, here we go. Thank you, Kimberly Wood, because it's Wooden Wednesday, by the way. All right. For those of you who have been on my jock for a long, long time. Sorry. 12-year-old humor. All right. Oh, I love, I love MSU, too. Okay, thank you. Uh, Michigan State University. Uh, I'm originally from Michigan. For those of you who loved this, journal it's eight by eight with watercolor paper and the decal edge guess who's getting that back in i hope i ordered enough i uh, these are not cheap nor am i um this it comes with like the vellum in between i have them coming in they're probably going to arrive any day i'm going to put them on the website but i'm not going to put them on until i have them in my hot little hands because they've been on back order for 552 years so for those of you who wonder about let's I usually get until 5:45 to chit chat. Let me just throw this down here. All right. What am I standing on? Why is my floor sticky? Oh dear lord. This is an 8x8 eight eight beautiful watercolor album. It is not the most inexpensive thing you'll ever use in your life, but she is outright pretty. Oh my goodness. I save all the good stuff for this book because I love this paper so much. It does tear out, but dear Lord, I don't want to tear it out because I love this book so much. All right. And it comes with this vellum. Ooh. Okay. Love me, my military people. Hello. Okay. All my kids were born in San Diego at Balboa Hospital in the military. So that gives you an idea. Oh, yeah. See, I save all the good stuff. This actually all lifts up. Okay. This book is coming back in. It's my favorite book in the whole wide world. All right. Enough about that. I just was super happy. <laughs> okay, Sandra, I was looking for that. I feel like I might, uh, I might, could do it just as Sandra. you there, girl. All right, here we go. Um, so every week, oh, I know it's sticky on my feet, the painter's tape that just landed on my foot. All right. So uh, any questions that you do have, I try to answer them. If I start uh, painting and I don't see your question and you start yelling at me in capital letters, uh, I'm sorry, I'm human. I can only do what I can do. And um, I don't have a supply list to begin with. But when we're done, this goes on my blog 
It goes with the materials list. I give links to the things I use, but I always say this, and I come from a very uh, truthful place. I create from the space I'm in on Wednesday nights. Uh, so that's it. Uh, I don't do a supply list in the beginning. I have let you know. There's watercolors. I encourage you to paint with me. Just let it go. Who cares what it turns out? It's only a piece of paper in your journal. It's a piece of paper in your diary. Cassie, yes, I'm selling those journals on my website when they come in. They haven't come in. Yes. So did I finish everything? I finally made it back. Hi, Kim Parsons. So welcome. And I want to thank you guys all. I don't have a plan. I do have some colors I thought about. I'll take requests. But that's about it. Yes, uh, Cassie, I will be selling that. Okay. she's. Uh, you're welcome. Uh, anything else before I get started? Normally by 545, I'm painting. So let's, uh, if you want, I'll just switch cameras for a little bit. All right, all right, all right, all right. Somebody asked me today if I always have this energy level, and the answer is probably a little bit. Um, I'm going to see if I can switch this around. Hold on. Okay. I can still see you. I poured a glass of wine to have tonight. It does not taste good. Mm, that's all right. I can live with it. What do you want to paint? I'm going to tell you I'm in a mood. So I'm just going to paint from the mood I'm in. If you are lurking and just want to spectate, that's fine with me. What vitamins do I take? <laughs> None. I should at my age. Uh, I'm going to try to put my hair back so I don't have a hair problem. I know I've been a high energy person. Probably too high. I don't have a, well, we're just going to put a pencil in our hair. Um, I have been a high energy person my entire life. My mother used to say um, she just can't calm herself down. Okay found a hair clip. Okay. I gotta stay in. All right. So let's paint. Let's paint. I need a paintbrush now. I actually love Wednesday nights. So I know I'm a little, I know I'm a little extra because I love Wednesday nights. Now, uh, I had you, uh, pre-wet all of those, uh, watercolors because that helps a great deal. I like to grab out a little towel it's so great when you actually love your job. So it's not like work, if that makes sense. All right. That might make sense to you. Um, I grabbed a number six round watercolor brush. And then I'm just going to... Oh, 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 sorry. No, I'm not going to do anything until I hit record. I apologize. I did this last week and then I had to edit a time lapse video. I was not pleased by that. Okay, sorry. Oh, there is a gigantor fly right there. Oh, that's gonna tick me off. Okay, let me make sure that's recording. Great. It's literally a fly. Uh, if you, we, I live in San Diego uh, because we got all those rains and things. It has become just a fly fest where I live. Anyway, um, I dipped into the pink. This is a classic. The classic Prima um, watercolor set, and uh, that's all I'm using. So I am just going to come in here and paint whatever I feel like painting. I don't know what you want to call it. So once I get the inside of that little flower, I'm just going to wet down my brush. Penny, do you need to go outside? Because that's going to really tick me off. I'm just painting right now. Are you busy? I don't have a plan, so don't get mad. Uh, I Sometimes I hate Facebook. I had to log out and log back in. Linda, you can also go to my uh, YouTube channel. People are having 
much greater success. Now, how did I just paint that? Uh, I'll show you and we'll do it in pink. Are you ready again? So my pink has red in it. I am going to do, start from the middle and just work my way out. This is a round six brush, so there's nothing real crazy about it. I'm going to go intense in the middle. I was really thinking about something black and white, and then I started painting with pink, so I don't know how this happened. Okay, then just wet this down. If you're familiar with uh, peonies, uh, we don't have them locally. They're kind of hard to get. Maybe that's them. Maybe it's a rose. I don't know. I don't want anybody yelling at me that it's something I say it is and it's not. It's from Dr. Seuss. Now, if you really want, you can take a little bit of black and just throw that in the middle and just let it disperse. I, this is not what I planned. Oh, this dog is like how easy was that? Should we do a few more? You're supposed to be laying down. Okay, all right. What about uh, just a red one? Okay, let's come over here. Just using the tip of the, <laughs> so many jokes. And I'm just, my mother watches on YouTube the following day, and so sometimes she likes my jokes. Sometimes she says, you could do better. I'm just, just a brush. I'm just a girl. Anybody's first time watching me? <laughs> Last? <laughs> All in one? Just throw some water in there. Just throw some black in the middle. Kind of fun. You could also throw a little bit of yellow. Yellow is a lovely color to throw like right in the middle, like right. Just let it dry. I didn't really, this was not what I planned. Just wasn't what I planned. And the more water you add, just the fainter it'll get on the outside. All right? What do you think? All right. Oh, Linda said, I hope I get to stay. Facebook is not wanting me to watch this evening. We want you to watch, Linda. All right. If you look up Tracy Winesaffel Studios on... Let's try this again. Um, you can go to YouTube. I think many people are having great successes with that. You know, I planned on doing black and white. That plan is gone. So we do about five of those? What do you think? Yeah. Um, Linda, or uh, Linda. <laughs> Listen, Linda. Um, Anne might be able to give you a link to my YouTube channel. And um, Anne, if you go to the bottom of my website, you should be able to get that and throw that in there. All right. Hi, everybody. If it's your first time watching, I'd love to hear what made you tune in. Let, now let's mix red and pink and go over here. And throw a little bit of like, ooh, purple. Let's throw just a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Oh, not too much. Not too. Oh, that's purple. Oh, that just keep mixing because it'll. I do things in odd numbers, and five is my favorite number. So odds are I'm going to hit an odd number. All right. If you are just trying. And I just water as I go out, and that just kind of fades in. Ooh, okay. Look at that. Oh, one is the loneliest number that you'll ever know. Five is my favorite number, and that's not going to change. I think like a gigantor one right here, a biggie. I am just going to go all in, whatever there, okay, and I'm just going to go boop, 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 boop. You have to make the noise. 
most relaxing thing I've done all day. Now, you know, the middle is right here, and then I can just keep building, but we're going to go larger because we're going to, don't worry, Penny, you're pacing and you're making me nervous and I'm supposed to be relaxing. Do you want to say hi to everybody and then get out of Dodge because you're driving me nuts? I said large, so we can go even into this guy. It's okay. You're just... Oh. Do we need to see Penny so I can send her off into, let's see, this needs to dry anyway before I decide what's going in next. So let's, I, I added a little bit of yellow, just, just a little bit. And yeah, let the middle just go and do its thing. It doesn't have to be, okay. All right, let's see. Come here. I'm going to send you out. You're making me nervous with your little... Come here. Okay. You want to say hi real quick? This is the studio. Okay. No kisses. You want to say hi? Up oh, right there. Up. Oh, I told you. No kisses. That's Penny. All right. I'm going to send her off into the universe. Come on. Go. Come on. All right, she don't want to leave. Go lay down. Go lay down. That's too much for me. Go lay down. You're just pacing. Okay. <laughs> that would be my doggy. All right. Did you all decide if you're good with this? What I think I'm going to do... <laughs> my dog matches me. <laughs> do you like my... Uh... <laughs> Uh, do you want green leaves on this? I was going to do black. I was going to do like black lines. I'm going to fill this page up. I'm not feeling the green. Am I? Are you feeling the green? Do you want green or do you want like black with little vines and little like, I know this is weird. Penny, if you don't sit down, you're getting kicked out. Green leaves, green leaves, green leaves, black. <laughs> little hearts okay hold on do it black. okay oh i'm just keeping a black will be cool so then i'm going to fill in some more flowers vines black and green black and green do both i thought green until you said black but let's just try something different okay all right Whatever you'd like. <laughs> Whatever you'd like. Then I'm going to stick to what I said originally, and then I'm going to, ooh, I'm going to mix the purple. Okay, you know, these are mixing wells. I, I don't even put them in the wells because I'm lazy. But here we go. So let's do this, and let's come up with a different color in here. And really, all I'm doing is just adding water. Mm. Just adding water as I get further out. Oh, don't forget the little bit of black in the middle. You can also throw a dash of that yellow in the middle because it's fun that there's something in the middle. All right, now we're going to have to keep track of numbers. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, there's not going to be six. That's for sure. All right. I really am digging on you, digging on you. And yes, you can go over an existing. Okay. 
I had friends over tonight who were cooking me dinner. <laughs> All I had to do was supply the barbecue in the house. <laughs> Which was easy peasy, light and squeezy. So, okay. Okay. I just throw in just a little dot of each. All right. Bottom left. Bottom left. Oh, I'm throwing more in. Oh. Okay. It's a big drop of water right there. I do kind of need this to dry at some point. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. And then I'm just going to wet this and just do like right here, just right. Like just inferring there's something there. Okay, got it. There's something there. Yep. Okay. And then there's. If it helps you, I do this sometimes where I just start painting on the uh, tape. I know that sounds crazy, but it gives me just what I need. Okay, good. And then the, okay. Okay, I think I'm good. I think I'm good. Now we have to have this dry somewhat. We have to have this dry somewhat. Heat gun. Somebody asked what's the difference between a heat gun and a hair dryer? The temperature. Now for those of you who say I cannot paint or draw, I did not draw. I was flicking my brush, wasn't holding it correctly. There were no brush strokes. Uh, much clearer on YouTube. Great. We should be giving the YouTube link out to people. I hope I don't mess this up because now I really love it and now I feel like I'm gonna mess it up. That's the spirit. <laughs> no, I like it. I could fill this whole page up with this and I would be happy. So if you can't feel like you can't paint, don't worry. Just have fun and relax and know that you can paint. You just don't know it. Uh, there we go. I want to make sure this is completely dry. There we go. I gave that one. I don't want them. Ah, oh, there we go. Um, Kim said, I feel like I can almost make these flowers. You can make these flowers. The white highlights, that just was, yeah, easy peasy. All right, I am going to grab, uh, I'm going to see if I have, yes, I do. This is where the part gets a little complicated. Just don't mess this up, girl. Okay, you ready? I'm taking black. I was hoping to do like little, like, first we'll start with this. We'll do this. Oh, just hang with me, please. Oh, this is not a good brush. I don't like that brush. I need something a little bit smaller. Okay, this, this should work. This should work. Oh, even this brush is difficult to... Probably going to go back. I'm just going to use a liner brush for this because there we go. 
Don't be afraid, Tracy. Just go for it. Just go for it. Now, it might be easier if you twist your paper a little bit. Uh, but I'm just going to, like, go in here and just start drawing, like, random things. Like, you know, little uh, whatever these are. Whatever these things are. Just little things. Oh, yeah. She good. And then I'm going to, they're going to. Just little dots, just over the top, over the bottom. Now my idea, like I said, was originally I'm going to come in with some black vines. So that's what I'm doing. Okay. Uh oh, I hear the fire trucks or the fire planes going up. Ugh, that's never good this time of year. All right. It's actually hard for me to draw these upside down. So excuse me if I have to flip my paper. I'm just putting some random little... watercolors. We haven't, I, I could be doing this in pen, by the way, but why, why when I can just come in and have a little fun? All I want to do is have some fun. Yes. What time is it? Six oh nine. Doesn't have to be perfect, does it? Doesn't have to be perfect. Okay. And the reason, I mean, I could use acrylic paint, make this so much easier, but I'm not gonna. Ooh, I have this idea though. Hold on. I'm sticking the back end of my, oh yeah, it works. Okay. The back end of your paintbrush, this works with acrylic. I wasn't sure it was going to work, but look at this. Yeah, it works. Yeah, just, just making little. Don't tell me you can't paint because we're just having fun tonight. Okay. Do, 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 do. I have to add more water. Tell me wants to know if there's going to be curly cues. I don't know. I don't know. I am like, literally, that's not a bad idea. I'm using the end of my brush just to make some little dots and just let them trail off. What do you think? I feel like this little nakedy section needs something more. So let's just go up 
And let's just go boom, 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 boom. If you make the sounds, you'll be better off. There we go. Just a little bit. I don't know why I wasn't. Uh, okay, hold on. Now I'm going to go up. And I'm going to do this and this, this and this, this and this. All right. And then off of that, I'm going to do this. All right. So there's just another leaf with a little stem. Oh. All watercolor. I have not whipped out my black uh, pens like I want to. I am um... I don't want to get too much. Oh. We're going to do a, another one right here. As I say, I don't want to do too much. I'll just sit here and keep going until I do too much. It's kind of like what I do. Uh, you can wet down that black a little bit and just let the... Oop. Good. I don't know if I'm going to do much more, uh, which I feel weird saying. Just kind of giving it a little border, a little this, a little that. Well, this was my mood today. Okay. I'm so glad you did the black. I wouldn't have tried it if I hadn't seen it. Love this so much. This would be a pretty silk scarf. Thank you, Hitomi. Pretty flowers. Love this so much. Guys. Hey, Kind of debating. Oh, tell me where I'm like, I know I'm going to look at this tomorrow and be like, oh, that wasn't like totally balanced. No, I just, I don't even want, no. Okay. All right. If you want to add too much and get mad at yourself, I can lead you there. <laughs> if you want to add a little bit of detail now that things are dry, you can take that liner brush. Okay. Like in the red here. Okay. Ready? I can just come around and make little squigglies and little details. Do, 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 do. So let's add a little more definition to our lovely little flower. Okay, let's go to the pink. Oh, yeah, because that now that like pink is just living its best life in that watercolor. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm just a little squiggly. Nothing too in-depth. I'm actually painting with you, lady. Oh, I like that. Oh, whoops. I can go right here. See, remember that little well of what I got do, 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 do. You guys, sometimes I feel I have nothing left in the engine for you, and I wonder what you're going to get, and I get scared for you all. And then somehow God says, this was your purpose, and this is what you're supposed to be doing. Give it your best shot. 
Hit me with your best shot. Okay, let's not go overboard. Why don't you hit me with your best shot? Fire away. Okay. Okay. I'm just mixing colors as I go. Because I'm happy to be here with you. All right. Oh, no, we have a problem, Houston. I just ran that. No, I don't care. Because that's what happens when you're playing with art. Okay. And if you a little, if you need a few more polka dots, just add them. If you need a little splitter splatter, add it. I'm not going to do any more. I'm afraid I'm going to ruin this, and I like it. I was, like, thinking about a border. Oh, I know what I'll do. Okay. Uh, should I stop? <laughs> should I stop before I jack this all up? Uh... Hit me with your best shot. Who sings it? I do take requests as well. I just know that when I start singing, life can't be that bad. A lot of stressful things, but life ain't that bad. Like, yeah, I kind of want to splatter it, but I'm not going to touch it. I feel like if I touch it anymore, I'm going to ruin it. I just like where it went. I'm a little bit happy. I'm a little bit rock and roll, and that's it. Like, that guy's kind of lonely. I don't know. Stop touching it. Oh, now I'm running into the cord. Okay, just Tracy, stop. Okay, everybody, please help me name the painting. Every week, I make sure that my paintings are named... And because of you guys. I don't like naming my artwork, but my team, uh, you, oh, I just burnt myself with a heat gun. Sorry. So, oh, pretty peonies, or peonies. It says peonies in my brain, so I say it. Pretty peonies, we have two. It's pretty peonies. <laughs> Even though we really don't have peonies, but I see them this time of year, it makes me happy. And I know the black was a little something. Do I leave the border with nothing, or do I just draw a line around it? Or do I draw a relaxed line with a little, like, doodly, doodly, doodly? You guys know what I'm saying. Or just leave it like nothing. Because the fun of this is removing the tape. What do I do? I can either do a thin little black line or I can do th two little thin black lines that are make it a little more doodly and relaxed. Leave as is. Okay, I've seen two leave as is. Relaxed with a doodly. Nothing. Don't touch it. Relax doodles. Oh, you guys, please just be one or the other. No. I like to show you options. I do put everything on my blog. I mean, everything. Uh, leave it. I'm going to leave it. I feel more leave it than I do. Okay. For those of you who say you cannot draw, I did not draw. For those of you who said I did not paint, I really did. I do not paint. I really didn't paint. I just let something, there were just little relaxed brush strokes. And I'm not really uh, a, a doodly line. You choose. Okay. I'm going to choose nothing. And then you guys can decide. And if you want, like if I look at it and I don't like it, I can add it at the end. But if I were going to do it, I'd add the line right now around my little taped border. And then I'd add a second. Love it either way. I'm going to try these flowers. So we're going to remove the tape. I'll know, I'll know the second I start removing the tape. And then I'm going to tell you if I like this or not. Yeah, I'm at peace with it. Okay, I'm good. I did not want to start. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Guys. <gasps> yeah, I'm good. Sign your 
name to your artwork. Sorry, Penny didn't mean to scare you. Oof, that glass of wine does not taste good. Oh, I just spelled my name wrong. Can't tell though. Because <laughs> nobody knows how to spell my name, <laughs> including myself. I like the black round, but it still looks great. Okay. Probably see somebody's, uh, your Artful Journey members. You are to go in your Artful Journey and you're to post your homework. Uh, actually, Wednesdays are just practice for us. You know what? I would have probably do a little splitter splatter, but I didn't do it. I'm fine. I'm happy. In under, uh, we were just like at a half an hour. Oh, Rambling Roses. I know. I don't even name. All right. Penny's knocking on my door. Somebody's knocking at my door. Somebody's ringing my bell. Do me a favor. Open the door and let him in. <laughs> okay. What do you think? Anyway, uh, I will post this on my blog, the video, the replay, um, my materials, everything goes there. If you look uh, below here, if you're looking for the supplies, this hand, if you're looking for the supplies I'm using where it says tracywinesapples.com uh, slash resources, my blog is over there. Um, uh, my resources, everything I use. Here's the thing. Um, in the next couple of months, yours truly has a couple of things going on. Number one, uh, I am making improvements to my e-commerce site, which is exciting. And number two, my website is getting a whole new facelift, which is going to integrate everything. And uh, I'm excited because I just signed on that today. And I'm hoping in come July, we're looking at a new me. There you go. Uh, actually, <laughs> you'll be looking at a new website, not a new me. This will be the same old thing you're used to. Uh, my uh, tr Joanne said my stamps arrived so quickly. Um, your shipping department works incredibly fast. If you're wondering, I do sell all of my own painting surfaces. I do sell office supplies and or office supplies. I don't sell office supplies. I sell art supplies on my website, some of my favorite products. But I do custom cut surfaces. Like if you want to turn this into this, you can do that. I cut these out. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, mama mia, <laughs> mama mia. I don't know how that happened. Again, 12 year old humor. Anyway, if you, I know, um, I, 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 uh, so funny. The team that I have that works with me, weirdly enough, all women, um, so amazing. Uh, my new website designer, a mom of twins like me, uh, I said early on in January to Anne, if it doesn't align with my gut, I will not do it, and I have held true. Also, I said at the beginning of the year when I hired a few new people, and they said, how would you like to run your company? And I said, with full transparency. So that's what I'm doing. I swear to high heaven, if this time lapse didn't record, I'm going to be mad. So um, thank you for saying that um, I am delivering things in a timely manner. Uh, it, if it doesn't work for me, it's not working. So Joanne, thank you. I, I appreciate your kind words about that. Uh, I don't know about being amazing. I think if I could moderately be okay at 53 years old, that's okay. And I appreciate you guys. Uh, for those of you who say you don't know how to paint, please don't let that stop you. Work through it. I always say my artwork goes through the uglies, 
but just do it as an exercise for yourself. It's a type of meditation that will make you feel better. <laughs> Julie said, I crack, I, that I crack her up. I am. Um, yeah, I, I am so, I am so thrilled. Just weird. I've gone through a lot of changes since January and in January I thought, Oh boy, how are we going to do this? Anyway, a uh, great thank you, Alice. That was a very sweet, sweet thing to say. Uh, look, at the, I don't know about amazing, moderately okay, you guys. All right, don't forget if you wet your watercolors, if you wet your whistle like I am, no, if you wet your watercolors down as much as I do, leave them out and open because uh, you don't want things growing in your watercolors. Not a good thing. You want them growing in your garden, but not there. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Don't forget, you can check out my blog. And if you have any questions or anything, you can always send an email to support at yourartfuljourney.com. To your Artful Journey sisters, we, I just uploaded Creative Time Live from Monday. It's all in there. You get my content right away. No wasting time. Um, Kim wants to know if I use distilled water. No. You mean in my watercolors? No. Nope. I just use H H2O. Two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen. I had to think about that. No distilled water. It's distilled water. It's the same way. Nope. I don't use anything. This is just regular tap water. And this is not anything special. It's a water bottle. Uh, I don't. Uh, my reservoir here, all tap water. I think I've only used distilled water in my life. What do you use that for? I use it in my laser. <laughs> That's it. And my wood cutting machine. I don't know what it's just distilled water is for. Okay, Kim. She said no. Okay. No, it was magic water that makes the flowers turn out the way they do. No, it's nothing magic about what I'm doing. There was nothing up my sleeves other than my fatty arms right here. Uh, that was it. Oh, ironing. You, you, oh, see, Beth just pointed out that I use um, distilled water for ironing. I don't iron. Yeah. So that's good. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Used to use it in my wire. Elizabeth, so nice. Um, yeah, only in my iron. And I don't think I've ever put distilled water in my iron, which is why I don't iron. Yeah. Oh, Kim, good point. She said, no, as long as you let your watercolors just dry out, some people close them up and put them in their bag. And that's just not good for them. You just want them to dry out. Also, you don't want to, I mean, my watercolors are used and abused. Oh, uh, Sue uses it in, in her steam mop. Nope. Yeah, me, nothing. I have a steam mop. I use regular H2O. Anyway, I'll, I like to drink distilled water. Somebody needs to tell me what it is. I just know I have to use it in my laser. I don't know. Thank you. Thank you for asking. All right. Thank you. Have a wonderful evening. I am here every Wednesday night as much as I can be when I'm not traveling. I am not traveling in next week, so I will be here. Kim says, I refuse to mop. I use my feet with a couple of... I have actually mop slippers, if you ever are looking... Isn't distilled what you use in your stills for moonshine? <laughs> mm, you know what? That's what this tastes like. It's moonshine. Happy Wednesday, you guys. Thank you for making my world just so much happier and doing what I love. I'll talk to you guys all next Wednesday, if not before your artful journey. Get in there and share your artwork. Talk to y'all later. Have a wonderful evening.